Hello, everybody. I'm Austin. And I'm Dan. Hey, we're here to play games. Badly. Yes. I was exploring a little bit just to kind of get back into the groove of things. This is Mika and the Witch's Mountain. Um, and I found this guy. He's like a kappa or something. He's adorable. Yeah, some kind of. He's I also just found, hanging out in a little fountain here. Yep, yeah. I also found a yellow orb we were looking for that last time, and I don't remember where it goes anymore. So that's going to yeah. be fun. I think it's I know. Pretty yeah. I think I know, but I don't remember. So It's a pretty good orb, so, you know, that's good. Yeah, I can sit here and ponder it for a while. You can ponder your orb, yes, yes. indeed. Uh, last <laughs> time we made a bunch of different deliveries, and uh, we are now at the point where we need to go back to Allegra. But I'm not going to do that just yet. Ooh, can I? Can I scoop you up? Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> that turned into a whole thing. I want to hold off on that for just a second. Interesting. Yeah, for real. If this is your first time here, welcome. We like to have a lot of fun. We're goofy. Glad to have you here. If you want to see uh, Mika from the first episode, you can check the card in the top right-hand corner. I've got a little link for the full playlist, uh, but otherwise, welcome back or welcome to the fray. I don't know, however you want to look at it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really cute game. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Agreed. Yeah, I love this game. Uh, I love this costume as well. The gigantic bell on the yeah. collar is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and you, she's got the earrings too. Yeah, the matching earrings. I was going to point that out. That's awesome. Um, oh, one other thing I did off screen accidentally was I had broke a kid's sandcastle and got an achievement for it. <laughs> so, um, what was the achievement? Oh, uh, I don't remember the name of it. I'll have to uh, look it up. Hold on. Uh, Outstanding. Yeah, I can, I can tell you here in just a second. Yeah, very good. Uh, it's me castle, but it's Mika. <laughs> yeah. Uh, -huh. that's adorable. It, yeah. And then the, uh, the other thing I did was I bought the last charm cause we had at least 10 of those little dudes. Um, mm. so all we have left is find the last or the, uh, costume. Okay. And, and get the rest of the tarot, right? Yeah, of course. Get the rest of the tarot. But I just meant for the, um, for the, like what the dudes exchange for. Ah, um, yep, yep, yep. So those little like statues, they exchange for the, the charms. When you get all three charms, you get the achievement. Have you seen my keys? So sharing all of that now. Onto the main gameplay, what you're really here for. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, sweetie, what a little thing. <laughs> what? You're not a frog, you're a kappa? And what are you up to? Um, are you trying to pass through the fountain into the spring? <laughs> I get it. You want to visit the heart of the mountain, right? <laughs> of course you do. Oh, interesting. Oh, that's so cute. Little frog pal. All right. Well, the heart of the Kappa is right over here, or the heart of the mountains right over here. Interesting. Very interesting. I really like this broom trail, the stars one. Oh yeah. Yeah, we got a bunch of star trails last, or not star trails, but broom trails. What? Yeah. Where'd the kettle come from? <laughs> Just finding all kinds of stuff in here. You have so many things. I know, right? Oh, someone teapot. left the teapot. They when they left the mine. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it makes perfect sense. I, I would have run away in a hurry as well. Uh, that's probably uh, you lose if I had to guess then. Oh. All right. Let's go deliver it. Yep. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, hold on. Hmm. Hmm. We're gonna do this real quick because I have to drop that. You must. <laughs> I love how many things you're carrying. It's great. Yeah. What am I gonna do here? Here, let me. Oh, here we go. Flip a table first. Here you go. What about it, rich pub? I think it's a kappa, but I'm not sure. Anyway, after finding this little guy chilling in the shell ponds, I had the feeling that it was trying to reach you, the heart of the mountain. Now look at its face. Isn't it cute? It's really happy to be here with you. 
Witch pup, I've told you so many times. I wish to be alone. After complaining that you were left alone for years. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> nah, you can't fool me. I can see you smiling too. Yeah, I think it is adorable. But that doesn't mean... Yeah. Shh. Rumpy, it's decided. I'll find them all. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Little frog pal. What? The rings activated again? Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> no, my my yellow orb. Okay, well, the yellow orb was in this area, so it's fine. I go find it again. You, you cannot has no. I wonder if there's like a... Oh, three of them. Okay, that's not too bad. Ooh. Whee! Ow. Oh, boy! Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh... Oh no, it did dam it damaged the teapot. I should have known better. Oh no. It's okay. That's gonna mess with the delivery. Oh no. Uh yeah, it might. Alright, so you there's drinking that. tonight, by the way. Oh yeah, this is tea time after all. Um It is. <laughs> I am drinking throat therapy. Ooh. Uh which is Adagio T's like um well, as it says, throat therapy. Um, what? Um, yeah, what's the flavor of that and it's, type? It's like a white tea. It's got, um, I want to say it's got like a, a licorice, black licorice and some other stuff in it. Okay. Um, I can't remember all the details, but it's specifically meant for um, when you're dealing with colds and sore throats and stuff. So Yeah, it seems similar to Tazo's... Um, Lot sweet orange. I always do that one whenever I have like a sore throat or I'm under the weather. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is your hey. teapot, right? Hi, young <laughs> nipper. How you doing? Hey. Oh, hi, you, Lou. Well, look, I'm for the owner of this teapot. I can't explain it, but I know the owner is pretty close. Huh? Oh, is that how? Or how's that? <laughs> um, it's like someone misses the teapot so much I can just feel it. Um. Oh, wow. Like, um, as if the teapot has more than just a kitchen accessory? <laughs> Say, I like it's a memento or some very dear, like a family member, and the owner is a person very far from home, and um, the teapot is a link to home. <laughs> yeah, exactly. How did you know? Wait, this is yours, isn't it? <laughs> 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 yes, it is. Well, in fact, it was my mother's. <laughs> all right, so my intuition wasn't so bad after all. Here you are. Um, Aww. you cool, you Lou? Yes, young nipper. It's just it's hard to be so far away, and the smell of tea. Bring back memories. I miss you, Mom. I'll be back soon. Now I'm free. I promise. <laughs> hey, it worked out. It did. <laughs> All right. Uh, so you asked me what tea I was drinking. What tea are you drinking? Good sir. Good sir. So, so I, I have mentioned this one. It's one of my standbys. I am drinking Republic of Tea Dragon Oolong today. Um, it's got a really soothing flavor profile to it and especially when it's warm it does change a little as it cools so mm. i am making my way through it uh but yeah it's it's one of my favorites i really like it along with um uh the the proper brew um black tea the uh i i don't know why i always space on the name of it what is wrong with me hold on <laughs> uh I don't know why you have to tell me about putting out fires every time I get the sponge wet. Gotta put out all the fires with the sponge, man. Yeah, I guess. Yorkshire. Yorkshire tea. Uh, yeah, I think nowadays Dragon Oolong and Yorkshire tea are my favorites. Um, mm. They're both quite tasty in different ways, actually. Um, but yeah, I, I do want to pick up again the uh, uh, Black Mango. Uh, tea that I got that I don't remember exactly who makes that one, but that's also a really good one. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep, I love mango. Olive, olive mango. Uh, I went the wrong way. All right. How does pondering your orb go? I don't even know, man. Hmm, I know that feeling. 
Oh, I did get the jar that was floating over here too. The tarot card that was in this jar was the tower. Oh, the tower. Excellent. Yep. And as you can imagine, it looked like the uh, windmill that we just passed. The tower is one of my favorite tarot lately. It's uh, it's definitely been an interesting piece of information to to go with or with over. Yeah. It's been interesting part of our our journey in the last few games. Yeah, yeah, I do feel like. 2024, if you will, has been... We've got a lot of tarot going on. Yeah, so. I agree. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh. Huh. Guess it's not this one. All right. Where does it go? We should ask the frog. We should ask the frog. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where it goes. Hmm. <laughs> Mind taking a gander for me, Dan? Yeah, no problem. Which orb is this? How should I identify it's it? It's just a yellow orb. There's probably a couple okay. different pedestals that yellow orbs can go into. Because we yeah, use like the me... blue orbs for the uh, the big boosty bits out in the ocean. Hmm. Yellow orbs are supposed to do something. That one had a blue orb on it. And I just don't Let's don't rightly see. recall. Yeah, um, there are consoles next to platforms that activate an airstream for yellow orbs. Oh, that might be a yellow orb spot. Let's see what that's hmm. Let's take a yeah, look. Could be that. Yeah, could always try that. No, I think. Let me see here. I don't know what I'm doing. Me neither. Yellow. Consoles next to the platform. Okay, let me see what else we got here. I wonder if this is not like a thing we need to do yet or something. Well, maybe not. May not be able to access it just yet. I like orbs. <laughs> Uh, 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 yes, you do. <laughs> yeah, this is this is sort of hard to to determine, determine. what to do with these. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We, we independently okay. came up with that phrasing at the same time, by the way, viewers. So <laughs> <laughs> we do that a lot. Yeah, we do. <laughs> yeah, it looks like yellow orbs create updrafts when placed on specific pedestals, but I'm not sure I can describe which pedestal it is. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, often finding the holder for the orb is harder than the orb. Yeah, that makes sense. It's It seems like the updrafts are not really necessary for those. So, you know, it's sort of hard to... Yeah, okay. Maybe we'll just head over to Allegra then. Sure. Oh, actually, there might be another one of those Kappa bros over there. Let me see if I can go ahead and get one. Kappa? Yo, Kappa Kappa. Kappa. Hmm. All right. Let's see if I can get up there. Let's be the real Let's say you. Gonna be the real question. Hmm, yes, indeed. Alright. Let's see. Can't go up that high yet. Uh, But I should be able to get over here. There is a Kappa dude. But I bet there's not a Yay. jar, because of course there's not. Oh, there's one. Perfect. Rabbit. He was just right next to him. That's very convenient. It is. This is very, very convenient. Yes, indeed. It's the last one up here. <sighs> hey, Austin. Hey, what's up? I bet it's gonna be hard to find a jar for that Kappa. You know, you say that, but like, watch this be the one that doesn't have a jar next to it. 
you're supposed to say, actually, it's going to be super easy, barely an inconvenience. Turns out it is, in fact, super easy, barely an inconvenience. <laughs> Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll shout out uh, the, the channel we are quoting there on that one, I think. I just felt the urge <laughs> to call out pitch meetings right now. <laughs> All right, and it should be, yeah, it's right down here. Perfect. Outstanding. And that'll be some more stuff we can get done today. Yeah. So, when it comes to the cards, how exactly are we doing with these? Like, we're still working on the same, like, card that's the just kind of our thing we're doing, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, we just kind of collect them and them as we go. Gambling about? Yeah. A little bit. You're here again with another copper? <laughs> yes! Little frog-like pal. Hmm. Hey, I think this one's the last one. Perfect. <laughs> so, how are they? Are they happy? They seem to be. At least that's what they told me. <laughs> Wait, they talked the whole time? <laughs> yeah, and trust me, they rarely keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, they spoke of the new winds that howl outside this cave. I would like to go outside, but I'm deeply rooted in these rocks. Aww. Oh no! Although I think there might be a way, which requires your handy cooperation, witch pup. <laughs> really? I'm all ears. Oh, it's an old ritual, quite difficult, in which I... Well, how can I put it simply? Hmm, okay. I will turn my spirit into a Mount Gon seed. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just as it sounds, witch pup. So once planted, I'll grow again where you bury my spirit. Oh. Wait, bury you said? So that means... Oh, unbelievable, you've given me faith in your kin again. Oh, and I know you'll choose a good viewpoint. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll help you grow out of this cave. Mount Gone Seed. Hmm. Ooh, so shiny. It is. I... But listen... If you want a good viewpoint, that means we gotta go even higher. That's right. We have to go so high. We may not be able to do anything with this just yet. Well, I'll take it with me. See if we can't figure out where this goes. All right. Seems as I have lost my yellow orb again. Who needs it? Yeah. I mean, we'll oh, find it again. <laughs> overrated. Yeah, I know where it's at. <laughs> That's what I meant. <laughs> okay. It does seem like they're just kind of optional things that aren't too necessary, so... Yeah. I think it's all right to wait on it. Hey, there it is. <laughs> yeah, I was to say, I know exactly where it's at, so... Oh, hey, there's one of those dudes. Gimme. Good viewpoint. Hmm. I wouldn't even know where to begin, honestly. I bet I gotta go further up. I don't think I've seen a space that would have... would be good for our... friend here. Friendo. Yeah. It's an interesting looking little object. For sure. It looks a little bit like the, uh... Oh, you know what? Do we know what this is called? Let's see. It's like a blue flower, right? Yeah, it's um, it's called Mount Gon Seed. Oh, the Mount Gon Seed. Okay. Honestly, I think. Has that been mentioned before? No, no, it hasn't. Okay. But I'm curious. Well. I'm gonna make it. Ah, yes. Looks like this has to go to Vanny. Oh, really? The whole the whole thing goes to Vanny. Looks like the Mont Gon seed goes to Vanny, yeah. Oh, okay, well, I definitely yeah. overshot Vanny then, because I was just over there. <laughs> That's all right. I gotta go through this sludge. Mm. All right. 
Oh yeah, Vanny was studying the vortex, right? Yes, I believe that's correct. Okay. Oop. I'm kind of curious what the new broom is going to look like when we finally get to it. Yeah, me too. It seems like it's taking a while to get to it. But... Well, it's it's like a daily thing, right? Because we, we changed yeah. days and we got a new broom. Yep. I oh, wonder how much right. better it'll be to fly as well. Hmm, that's a good question. Yeah. Me. Alright, Vanny. Vanny Vici. Yes. Hello, friend. How you doing, girl? <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Hi, Vanny. Uh, I need to ask you something. Hey! Hello, witchy witch. How are you? Wait. What is this? <laughs> oh, this? Mm, what do you think it is? Oh, no. Looks like quite a big seed. Let me take a closer look. What? Am I going crazy or is it like a heart beating side? <laughs> That's because it's the heart of the mountain. Huh? Really? Aww. Oh no, you're making that face again. Don't be mad at me, Vanny. Ah. Mad? Oh no, no, no. How could I? <laughs> you brought me <laughs> the biggest discovery of my life. Huh? Oh my. Ouch, my ears. Sorry, you know I tend to get really loud when I have this kind of epiphany, so... Stop yelling! Right. <laughs> Where did you find it? <laughs> How? Tell me everything. <laughs> oh, actually, I was expecting you to tell me something. You see, the seed comes from the ancient deity that inhabited Mount Gon. Uh... They were, or I guess still are, the island's magic source. <laughs> wow, Say so... what now? <laughs> right. Wow, so my hypothesis was correct! The heart of the mountain is... Yeah. Aha! What creates the wind currents, however... The heart was rooted in a cave, isolated and rather sad. Mm -hmm. They transformed into this seed so that we planted them out when planted outside the cave, they could see the outside world again. <laughs> okay, what matter transmutation? Botany. Hmm. I know a lot about those things, so what's the question? <laughs> yeah, yeah, so the question, um, do you know where we can plant it? Mm. Oh? Hmm. I think the seed needs a bed rich in magical sediment, and the only place I know like that. Mm. Is actually this place. Oh, that's handy. What? Mm. The Green Water Lake? Hey. How do you think the water gets its color? <laughs> All right. So, shall we plant it? Oh, oh Vanny, are you okay? Huh? Yeah, yeah. Um, I would rather do some test analysis and stuff before we bury it for good. This is the most important research asset I've ever come across, but... Instead, I can wait for the seed to grow and just talk to the heart of the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. I like Vanny. Yeah, Vanny's a fun character. She is. <laughs> she gets so excited. She does. <laughs> Just the greatest discovery of my life. Oh my god. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh Upward. hey. Word. That was handy. Very, okay. very handy. Handy dandy. Notebook. Handy dandy. Notebook. All right, let's go talk to Allegra. I think that's where we're at right now. Check myself here. Oh, really? There's an envelope there. Huh? A little shadow there? That? Yeah, that's to talk to Allegra. Oh, all right. Yeah. And then we've got two other things that we can collect and find for people. All right. So. Yeah. I'm assuming we can do that on the following day when we have access to more places. That sounds right to me. Yeah. So, let's do that. Let's do it. Eh. Only way out is through. What did we get this time? Death. You know, that makes sense, actually. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, so the reason why that makes sense, viewers, is we're playing Persona 3 Reload at the moment. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, uh, for those of you that know that game, you probably understand why that makes sense. For those of you that don't, trust us, it makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> He's the death of the mountain. Yep. All right. The mount. There are those who live in the mountain. Mm hmm. That's good. That's good reference. That is a good reference. I haven't watched those in a while. 
I should probably watch the extended editions again at some point. Oh man, I know I just watched them recently with my wife, but I would happily watch them again. Yeah, definitely. Allegra! So good. Hey, hey, girly. Allegra, um, how are the preparations for the art show going? Oh, that's right, I forgot that's what we were doing, was killing time. <laughs> Anything I can do to help? Uh -huh. Hi, little one. Well, now that you mention it, yes, there is one thing. I need you to deliver Andros an invitation! What? Uncle Andros? <laughs> so, Andros, you show your true form. <laughs> Why him? Andros is very unfriendly. Uh. Well, he's having a really hard time. His debts are such a burden on him to the point he can no longer paint. Uh -huh. He's in debt because he can't keep his children from out, out of his pocketbook. Mm, good point. He lost his inspiration and he can't sell his art anymore, so he's trapped in a vicious circle. Aww. Oh, I never thought about it like that. Mm. He needs to come to the party, get a change of air, talk to people. And I also have something in mind for him. I want Andros to take part of a guest artist as a guest artist. I have the feeling it'll be good for him. I have a feeling that Allegra is actually a witch. Anyway. I'll bet you that is correct. I've definitely suspected that there's some intentionality to us being down here and having to do all this stuff. Oh, yeah, from uh, the teacher. Yeah, I absolutely believe that. From the teacher and other people, Allegro would be the easiest one to be involved in whatever's going on right now. Mm -hmm. So It'll just be like, a, hey, yeah, of course, this is how we train witches or something. I don't know. We'll I'm, see. I'm so sorry I squished your sandcastle, buddy. I really didn't mean to. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> yeah, that was really unfortunate. <laughs> but you got an achievement, right? I did. Me cast Yeah. Totally worth it. Hey, look at the brats. Yeah. It's a turtle. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's an adorable turtle. He's just, I like that he's turtle. He's jamming out. He is. He's he's having a great time. What is? What do we got there? Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Deliver. Andros. Hello. Aww. Mr. Andros. Hi. Today I'm the bearer of good news, I promise. Uh, ah, Mika, there is no excuse. I was frustrated and for some reason I took it out on you. Hmm. Yeah, you were really nasty, but I accept your apology. Hmm. Ah, your gift. A treasure. I think you could, uh, spend some time with my twins. I teach them some good habits. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> are you serious? Ah, my whimsy profligate goblins. <laughs> So That's about, fantastic. <laughs> yeah, this is, so what about the great news, Mika? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, yes. Allegra is having a party and she wants the three of you to be there. <laughs> also, she wanted you to... An invitation to a party? For us? Absolutely not! I cannot afford to spend any more money. Ooh. Well, at least he gave us a green stamp this time. Uh, That's right. Um, Allegra didn't mention that you had to pay for anything. Um, no, I mean pay for proper outfits for the three of us. All our clothes are old and tattered. Ah, me. The greatest elite painter of my time. Um. The highest paid, the most fashionable and exquisite bad example. <laughs> I taught my twins what life was about embracing opulence. No savings, no plans. <laughs> um, what does opulence mean, Mr. Andros? Ah, uh. <laughs> uh, look at me. I'm a disaster of an artist. <laughs> I wish I could find some inspiration again, like when I was a child. Ooh, mm. yes. Let's do yes. that. Yes, let's gift those. Mm, I think I have another delivery for huh. you. Really? And what is it this time? Here, take them. My incantation temperas. Um. Tempera paints? My little imps, I assume. Bah, they will not appreciate them. <laughs> oh, no, no. For you to paint with. Although Miss Witch Oligari asked for them to practice arcane calligraphy. <laughs> anyway, you'll make better use of them. Oh, Mika, this is such a sweet and naive gesture. I'm a professional painter. <laughs> what could I possibly do with these chalky, dull paints? Paint a bluey, uh, plain <laughs> sea? Like a child? <laughs> with a what? block of blurry seagulls overhead, all bathed in a washed-out sun, tracing a faint reflection on the waves? <sighs> oh, no. <clears throat> um, wait here a minute, Mika. Where are you going? <laughs> he was inspired. <sighs> oh! <laughs> this is excellent. 
Outstanding. That's just the O's. Every time they have little to big, that's all I can think of is just how it's... (laughs) Yes. I'm powering up Super Saiyan! (laughs) It's over 9,000! This is to go even further beyond! (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) What just happened? Oh, what just happened? Oh, something so simple yet miraculous. You inspired me to paint again. (laughs) I did. What? Do you think Allegra would like this painting? I should give it to her for sending you here. (laughs) To be honest, I get the feeling she expected something like this. Really? Is she clairvoyant? Thus, my new painting is for her. It's decided. (laughs) Okay, on my way. Oh, and um, tell her we are definitely going to the party after all. I have something to celebrate too. Andros masterpiece. Perfect. Um, I'm gonna. You hold that for just a second. I've got a card to collect. I missed. Ow. <laughs> I just got an achievement for that too. Whack! Whack! <laughs> Hit the ground five times in a row. <laughs> Perfect. All right. There we go. The emperor. Again, makes Ooh, sense. Yep. That's he. We were just talking to him, weren't we? <laughs> we sure were. Okay. Now I will take your painting. Oop. There we go. We will not let it get wet, and we will take it over to Allegra. You know. I wonder if there's a reason why there are only 13 of the major arcana. Uh, in this I think game. there's 15, I thought. Oh, are there 15? Okay. Why there is an incomplete set of the arcana. <laughs> yeah. It might just be character limitation because uh, they seem to be associated with characters and locations, like key locations. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking is that it's just, you know, like how many characters can we actually do this yeah. for? So something? we need 23 more of the totems. For the last mm. costume. Okay. But yeah, so we got Temperance and the Devil, which is uh, Groff. That's mm. Mr. W. Soot. The Fool is Brom. We got the Tower, which is the Windmill. The Emperor, which is Andros. And the Chariot, which is our mom. So we're missing. You said. Yeah, you said Groff? I think that's his name. Okay, because you know what I thought of, right? <laughs> y- yes, yeah. I, I can't yeah. remember his name because it's been a minute since we've talked to him. Yeah, Since yeah. he fired us. Jerk. Yeah, what a jerk. Could be Gref, actually. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Groff, the seeker of power. That's, do you want the power? Do, 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 do you want the power? <laughs> Gref. It is Gref. Okay. Ah, Gruff, yep. All right. Groff is someone else. Yes, <laughs> that's a different show. If you are yes. interested in Xenogears, go check that out. Yeah, you'll understand who Groff is, kind of. Yep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Hi, little one. Tell me, how did it go? <laughs> uh, it went pretty good, I think. Mr. Andros apologized. <laughs> really? He's an unusual elit. A good exception. <laughs> what? He is a good exception? <laughs> So what about the party? Are they coming? Yeah, he was reluctant at first, but he accepted the invitation and gave me a painting. Uh-huh. Ah, I see, I see. Well, seeing how the whole island is values his work, it will give him a much-needed confidence boost. <laughs> I'm really happy for him, truly, in this painting. Whoa, it's a real masterpiece. It'll be in the center of the exhibition, just for everyone to see. Andros's masterpiece! Well, I think I have everything I need, so... Uh-huh. Are you ready for the party? <laughs> yeah! Party! <laughs> That's life, complete act three. Huh? <laughs> oh, yeah, that drone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Burb. Hmm. Benny. He's got a magic mushrooms over there. Mm-hmm. That's what it looks like. Aw, oh, Kiala. Hello. She's so shy. Yeah, indeed. Uh-huh. So, what do you think, little one? Looks nice, doesn't it? Yay! Allegra, 
it is amazing. Uh-huh. Ha, but I can't take all the credit. You did your part with the whole Andro situation. <laughs> <clears throat> also, most of the villagers helped as well. Speaking of which, um, I need to show you something we've all been working on. Uh-huh. But it will take a while, okay? Oh, what is it? Uh-huh. Uh-uh. I'll tell you when this time comes. Okay, okay. I'll wait. <laughs> anyway, I have a feeling that there are still things to do in the meantime. <laughs> mm, yeah, the cook looks like he could use some help. <laughs> oh, on my way. See you in a bit, Allegra. All right, then. This we is gotta a make the party happen. Yep. But we're gonna have to make it happen next time, because we mm. are at time for today. Okay. Yeah. So this has been very fun. Uh, I think um, I think we are approaching near the end of this game. I think so too. Actually, uh, we might have a little bit more to go because there is um, the actual climb of Mount Gone. Yeah. And there's yeah, also indeed. like various collectibles and stuff too. So we're not done, done, but we are probably pretty close. Yeah, we're pretty close to the end. So um, yeah, we will be. Um, if the next episode is the last one, we'll be moving to another tea time. I don't know that we have a plan just yet, but we will have one by the time we get there. That's and, right. Uh, it should be another adorable game, or at least a relaxing one. Hope you've had a good relaxing time watching us play this game. I know we certainly find it, you know, nice and calming. <laughs> so yeah, it's definitely been a real uh, thrill and joy to to play this one. I'm glad we went that route. Yeah, outstanding game. I love this game. Mm -hmm. uh, in the meantime, if you have liked what you've been watching, please uh, do us a favor. Hit the like button, subscribe, all that jazz, because it helps us out a lot. And uh, also share with a friend, like, hey, check out this cool Mika video, or hey, you guys should see how bad they are at Salt and Sanctuary. Um, <laughs> you know, we'll accept either one, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> right. Or anything else, really. Um <clears throat> Uh, because, you know, like I said, it helps us. And if you are wanting to catch up on something that you haven't seen yet, like I mentioned Xeno Gears earlier, uh, we have full playlists of everything we've completed so far, as well as uh, a filling playlist of anything that's current. So, you know, if you're wondering where episode one of anything is you found that you really want to know about, it's in a playlist, I promise. Just go find it. Yep. You'll have a good time. At least I hope you yes, will. Yes, indeed. Yeah, hopefully so. Um, you know, we've been getting a lot of in engagement with some of our playthroughs recently. Uh, the Xenogears playthrough has gotten a lot of engagement as well. So mm -hmm. shout out to that. We really appreciate the comments. Uh, it does take us some time or, you know, I'll call myself out. It does take me some time to get back to it sometimes, but it is very appreciated. So, um, <laughs> you know, do the likes, do the subscribes, comment, talk about stuff. It's appreciated. Uh, you know, obviously keep it respectful and uh positive and you know all of that good stuff but you guys are doing a great job of that so we really appreciate you yeah uh, and we love to hear from you absolutely uh in the meantime thank you so much for letting us be a part of your day hope you're able to decompress from a busy tuesday get your nice warm drink cozy up especially as the uh, colder months are on their way mm -hmm. unless you live in the south and then they're like <laughs> slightly less warm um a little cool months sort of maybe <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, less sweat months. Um, yeah, there you go. <laughs> anyway, either way, I <laughs> hope you're able to relax. And um, thank you for so much for letting us be a part of your day. We hope you have a wonderful one. And we will catch you all in the next video. Yep, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye now.